What's up? My name is Technoba here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I'll show you how to show FPS inside of Battlefield 2042. Now, usually I'd also release a video talking about how to show latency, but unfortunately at this current point in time, I don't think that's possible as the command in-game seems to be disabled for some reason or another. It'll probably work in the full release and I will mention it throughout the course of this video. Now, of course, as you can see, I already have an FPS counter in the top left, but that's from Steam. If you have the game on Steam, you can shift tab, go into settings, in-game, and turn on the in-game FPS counter by selecting a corner here and possibly enabling the high contrast color to make it green. Now, once in-game, you'll have to hit the tilde key, which is the squiggly line right below escape to open up the in-game console. Inside of here, we'll type in PERF, perf, overlay, dot, draw, FPS, space one. Upon closing it, in the top right hand corner, you'll see CPU FPS, SIM FPS, whatever that is, GPU zero FPS, and MP slash S, which is megapixels per second. Pretty useful information and does give you an idea of what could be bottlenecking you without you having to check your task manager. Unfortunately, at this point in time, I don't think there's a way to show latency in game. There is perf overlay dot draw latency graph, which when set to one doesn't really show anything more. And making sure that perf overlay enable is set to one, still nothing extra shown. So unfortunately, that's probably all the information we can pull out of the game at this current point in time. Now, of course, there is something in game that lets you show FPS or at least should escape options, general network. You can see I have show network performance stats here, which I can set to always or on problems, or of course, none at all. But when this is turned on, you don't see anything extra in game. Escape options. We can also show in menu. So I'll turn this on. You can see there's nothing showing here. Maybe it only shows on the main menu. In fact, let's quickly check that out. Mm, nope, that doesn't seem to be it either. I'm not too sure where this is supposed to show up, but I assume that when this is turned on sometime in the future, you should see network statistics, ping, lag, packet loss, etc. somewhere on your screen. Even if you set it to just on problems, you'll see it when you're having issues. And of course, when that is enabled, I'm sure the in-game command will be enabled as well. But of course, if you'd like to get more information, you can use something like MSI Afterburner and or River Tuner to get some extra graphs, latency, input timings, etc, etc. That is probably what you'd want if you want to really dive into it, though I'm not too sure about how much information you'd actually want to see. Usually just seeing raw FPS is more than enough, which is what Steam can do for you. Otherwise, you can use the in-game FPS meter to see what could be bottlenecking you as you're trying to optimize your game experience. But anyways, that's about it for this quick video. Thank you all for watching. My name's been Technobber here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.